Yep, this is 50% charge. That's good. I don't know why the bike has been running really economically. So I gotta say, maybe it's because I got that 16 inch t uh, wheel. I don't know. It seems like it's working less, is what I'm gonna say. We've gone, according to my GPS, it says we've gone 30 miles already. That's not normally how far I, I usually go. <laughs> so I'll say the GPS don't lie, man. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, let's go play around here and oval real quick. Yeah, it gets hung up on there a little bit. Slides nicely. Pass up in the corner. <laughs> All right, right here, I'll pass it. Is it gonna go wide? Is it gonna go in? Oh! I'm bullying a bunch of kids. <sighs> Alright, stay on him so I can get it, pass him in the jump. Here we go. Oh, holy moly! That jump is rounded off pretty well. Oh, these tires are great. They're great for flat track. Okay, I'm just gonna follow these guys around. Let's go watch these guys around. <laughs> oh, look at, oh, look at, he's gonna pass. He's gonna go for a pass. Nope. <laughs> I'm just gonna follow him. Oh, oh, he got past. <laughs> <laughs> I 
It's fun watching them ride. Yeah, that jump is nice and sharp. The other ones aren't. <laughs> like, try not to jump. Yeah, it's faster if you don't jump. <laughs> I just realized that. Because it's just not rounded off. It won't launch you, you know? Okay, I'm done. <laughs> That's some good, man. You know what? I'm not tired after that. I was just taking my sweet time. Whew. All right, now we're gonna go play around in the trials area. All right, we're gonna go do some trials. There's a little lake over there. Let's see if we can ride the plank here. Not bad. Let's see if we can go up that, that slab there. Uh, which one? Oh, that one over there. Let's go up this one with all the rocks. Oh, not bad. Man, this is some kind of high level trial stuff. Let's see if we can go on that slab and we'll jump off the right part and then try to clear it. <laughs> I don't know, man. Right there. Okay, that's what I wanted to do. Cool. There's a there's a plank right here. It's kind of sideways though. Okay, I want to see if I can go up this ledge here. All right, we're gonna go off this ledge and up this ledge. Oh, oh I didn't make it. So I hit it. I hit it at a weird angle. I hit it at an angle and it slid. Right. Let's, yeah, let's reset and so we can hit it straight. All right, here we go. Yeah, I hit it at an angle and the back slid on it. If we hit it straight, I think we got it. Yeah, nice. Good job. See, so much easier, right? Oh, what do we got here? Okay. Man, that's a tough one. We'd have to get the front up over there to get over that ledge. Get over that sharp tree. Uh, maybe get it, from, get it from the other side. Oh, let's see if we can just try to maneuver through that. Let's try that. Okay. Here we go. We're going to go through this way and go up these steps. Okay. Oh, hit the skid plate pretty hard there. It's okay, that's why we got a skid plate. I tried to roll down it a little bit. Let's go back up this. Oh, we got scared a little bit. <laughs> Dude, who does this? That's what I want to know. Damn, I want to see somebody do that because I'm not going to do it. All right, let's see if we can go over this, uh, this little... Horseback or whatever, I don't know. I don't know what to call it. Oh, nope. Right, let's go down here. I'm definitely not going up that. Let's see how good it goes up this. We'll go up the steeper part. Nice! Nice! Yeah, so I definitely like this setup for trials better. I don't like the 21 inch front for this kind of stuff. Ooh, that was easy. Okay, let's go on the, the shallower part. Nice. I tried to move a little bit slower. 
All right, let's see if we can go up that, that the back of that thing again. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, I know there's some stuff down here that we can try. Like this here. log there. Let's see if we can get up this ledge here. That's pretty, that's a pretty steep one. <laughs> Good luck, Eddie's Vega. Oh, I got it! Nice! Good job! Woo! I wish I had a video camera for that. That's pretty much it. We could have launched it off of here. I'll do that again. Yeah, I did good. There we go. Oh, there's just not enough. There's not enough runway for me to get off of this. We're just gonna go straight down it if we go off of it. Maybe, let's see. Oh, nope, not bad. I was able to keep the front up. Let's go up here, up there, uh. oh, I'm tired. Well, that's pretty much all there is for the haze making and do. I'm surprised at the stuff we got up though. Dorado Fork, good for, pretty good for trials. You wanna see if you can go out that pipe? That's kinda, it's kinda scary. <laughs> let's try. Okay, let's do a pivot turn here. All right, we're gonna go here. I'm gonna try to go up that pipe. We'll see if it does it. Oh, it's scary. Oh, I got it, yeah! Yeah, boy! Yeah, boy! All right, let's see if we can go down it. Let's see if I can do 180 pivot here. Nice, okay, we're gonna go down it now. Oh, 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 a little bit too much speed there. Okay. I think we're good. Let's go up these steps here. Oh, I went up and I chopped it. Oh, I ran out of power. Up down the ledge. Ow! My helmet hit the, the GPS. We got 36% left. Did we go up that? We did go up that. Yeah. We did go up that ledge. We went up that ledge during the um, the Coyote Creek Enduro, so that tells me we can do that. <laughs> Let's try. We're gonna go up this ledge here. Oh, I hit it and I kind of bounced off of something. Oh, here's a fun one. There's a, there's a little ramp thing there we can launch it off of. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna compress the fork, pop it. Nice. I splatted it a little hard, but I think we're good. All right, I think uh, I think I'm good. Let's see if we can do a donut. Is donut pretty good? Let's see if we can do two donuts. <laughs> All right.
We're just kind of just rolling all over stuff. But okay, I'm good. And for my last trick, we'll jump off the loading ramp. All right, cool. Hopefully we didn't break anything doing all that stuff, but that's good to put it through some extreme uh, workout. Okay, I'm done, I'm going home. <laughs> Okay, we're back, and I'm pretty much done. That low speed stuff, the, the NXT was still behaved. So just when you're riding it really, really hard, it gets like that. It helps if you shut it off and turn it back on. All right, so thanks for watching the uh, trials of the motocross, mini motocross portion. It was fun, the black rips. Um, and I, I feel like it's easier to get up obstacles than it was before. Yeah, I really like this setup. It feels proper. Feels like it's supposed to feel. Um, 21 in front, I didn't like it because it, when it hit, when you hit a jump, a bump, and you're trying to go over it, it goes straight up, and and it just keeps on rolling like it does a wheelie, you know. This one, this one, it uh, it kind of it goes up, but it jumps. It has like four. It carries more forward momentum. It's it's more f uh, the trajectory is flat when it jumps up. Anyway, I'll go over it in the the after action review. Check that out. But I'm pretty much done. We are at. We are at 40% charts, 70 volts, and we rode 32 miles and hit a max speed of 39.5. And we had a moving average of 21.5 miles an hour. And we were moving for one hour, 30 minutes. And we were out there a total of two minute, two hours, one hour, 29 minutes. And then the total time we were out was two hours, uh, 0 0.6, 0 0.6 uh, hour, 2.16 hours. <laughs> Or two hours and 16 minutes, all right? Yeah, 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 okay. Uh, okay, so I'll go over my thoughts of the whole day uh, when we get back. All right, so I'm gonna throw this thing back on here and head on home. All right, here's me on. Well, I'll tell you this. I haven't ridden, I haven't ridden in a minute, all right? I haven't ridden since the last time we raced this. That, that's the last time we went dirt biking. And I have to say, after riding it through all the trails and, and ripping on it and stuff, it is excellent. I like it. Um, it's a little loose out there today, so I'm, I'm slipping and sliding a little bit. If we had a little more hero dirt, I think we could do a little better. Uh, but yeah, dude, uh, I'm really, really happy with this setup. Uh, however, I feel that the rear is too too stiff. Um, for everything else but like washboards, it's okay. It, it, I can deal with it, but the washboards, it's... It's like you're on freaking paint shaker, man. <laughs> That's what I'm say, man. Yeah, it's like you're riding the jackhammer again, but it's your feet this time. So my feet are going to take a beating. Um, anyway, I'll go over it in the after action review, but I, I definitely, I don't feel as uh, as tired as I normally would, all right? I, I, I'm not getting the arm pump, okay? Yeah, I'm not getting arm pump at all. So that that's the $1,500 difference, man, or $1,000 difference. That's the $1,500 versus the $500 shock difference. <laughs> big difference. Uh, big, and my, and my arms can attest to that. <laughs> All right, here we go.